Hey, yeah. hey, Welcome yeah. back, it's your boy Heater and the flow sick with the whole feature. It's your boy Hussa, you know that we live. Now drop a like and then be sure to subscribe. We're back, reacting to One Piece and believing we're truly excited to witness the legend of Luffy because he's on a mission to prove he's the king of the pirates. Uh -huh. Much love to Thug Nifus, yeah. we appreciate your pledge. Now we're not for the track, it's time to react. We're ready for what happens next. Ooh, stuff changing colors. Mm hmm. I thought that was a number. <laughs> Dang. First. Give him some flames. Cut that song a little bit. <laughs> yeah, you tripping. Huh? Oh, what? Yeah. <laughs> that was being dramatic. Now you talking again. Pulling a chopper. Get punched. Yeah, party pooper. They need to go attack Queen with that same skill. All right. What? Get Marco. Go scratch Queen. Don't do it. Make it make sense. Oh, right. That can't happen. Marco can kill you too. Facts. They're conflicted. Yep. Yeah, Somebody to... talk to him. I'm going to take a dive. Right. Pull a guard. Mm hmm. What if he doesn't pull his punches, though? <laughs> and knock your whole block off. <laughs> yeah. For the gang. Mm. You're looking ungrateful. <laughs> <laughs> they tiptoeing over there, though. Taking their time. Conflicted. Do it. Yeah, Get the mini down gun. here. Oh, I thought he was talking to Marco. He's talking to them. Yeah. Mm. You had no choice. Mm. He about to catch a 30 piece. I'm an OG. Mm. First to die. He just let himself get stabbed. Mm. <laughs> Go crazy. Oh, setting them up there. Finally. Mm. We're taking flight. Mm. <laughs> With his glasses on. <laughs> I see you, bro. I see you. Yeah, I know you hate it. <laughs> Gosh, man. <laughs> he is chilling out here, bro. It's, Gotta it's looking goofy. Uncle Marco. Look at his face. Look at it. No, look, no, man, look, look at it, man. All right. All of y'all. Y'all next up. Talking about Ace. <laughs> Let me, Let go me back. box him. Mm. Oh, he did ask. Mm. Dang, man, replace him. What an honor. Yeah. Y'all yeah. ain't pull up. They all know the story. Mm. You do nothing? Couldn't be no worse than now. How? Like the Kazuki versus Orochi's bloodline. Oh, a man. civil war for power. Oh, man. You gotta ride with him, though. Come on now, white beard. Love ever. You hear he made a promise? Yeah. Mm. You ain't strong enough. Put some respect on that man's name. Oh. Oh. You're not him. He got lumped up for suggesting it. Got a two piece. KO. Hats off. Crap. Nah, he wasn't listening. Right. He didn't do it for the clout. I'm trying to free the land. Mm. Lame. <laughs> he really is talking trash. Yeah. Keeping promises. He just got promoted. Yeah. 
Your heart in your right place. No. If Pops give the go ahead. He didn't care about his brother. I'm ready to go right now. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Now look at me. Yeah, doing it for Ace. Mm, that's what's up. To the road down there together, man. That was the gang gang. They weren't ready. Yeah, they got there early enough. Shwing. Yeah, him beating Odin really shook him up. <laughs> yeah, Odin, he got Odin, cuz. Right, right. <laughs> oh, we not pulling up on that. <laughs> Who are you talking about, Whitebeard? In the gang. Nah, he didn't want the country to fall into shambles. That's no way to make it Had one of the greatest groups. Talking about the Whitebeard Pirates? Yeah, yeah. but they was hesitant. They were. <laughs> right. Sounds scandalous. Yeah, I know that hurt. The whole flashback? <laughs> right. He's conscious. He's we are reminiscing. Baby. Right, he punched Vivi. Mm -hmm. Get the him. hell out of Vivi. <laughs> if you're a woman, if you offend him, he gonna hit you back. That's a core memory. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's his guy, his hero. That's why I fight women now. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Slam Christmas all around after that. That I gave him. <laughs> <laughs> What's she call him? Usahachi? We're feeding folk dumplings. Oh, okay. Usopp's got her. Slingshot dumplings into their mouth. Yeah, we can take headliners. Yeah. Just don't want no parts of Toby Ropo. She about to be the MVP. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> the story is deep. It's all connected. Crazy, right? For real. Right. The will of D. Mm-hmm. Talk more about it. What do you know? Mm -hmm. According to the journal, the D is supposed to do this. Yeah. Mm. Who's she fighting with? Frankly? Kaido? Who we cooking? Oh, just getting his strength back. Oh. Uh, feeding feeding the fire. Some good old soul fire. Oh man. But he's getting right too. Mm. He's looking healthy. Full power big mom. Mm. Mm. With your greedy butts. Looking like a mom self again. Mm hmm Got his mama swagger back. Mm -hmm. He be looking high around Nami. Yeah, a little nervous. Mm. Here to block. Oh, they no. both are. Right. I'm up here too. Mm. Y'all too late. Get mm. shot. Bow. Two is out of his mouth. Pause. For real. How is he shooting those, bro? He's a shooter at all times, bro. Oh my oh, god. Oh, he's a cyborg. He out there like Frankie. Probably. Yeah. 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 Get locked down. Both of y'all. Same time. Mm. Just let him go, okay? He gonna throw him and drag them down so they can't chase. Ooh, what a play. Put them both in the headlock. Beautiful. Get over here, kids. Uh. Oh, that's gas. He's finally up there by himself. Well, the nine, oh. but they out of commission. Big Mom's there too. Mm. Bodies laid out together, mm. napping. Yeah, I did what I do. 
Ooh, I need her for the Poneglyphs. What about your daughter? Mmm. Oh. She ain't got the sauce yet. Oh. She's getting impatient. That three eye gonna come in handy eventually when reading the Poneglyphs. That's what she was banking on. It ain't happened yet. She gotta get awakened for hers. Mm -hmm. What? Minx catching hands. The Musketeers. They tired and hurt. Hmm. Even she, she. They've been running through the gauntlet ever since uh, Duke the and them set them inside. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't even remember them coming inside, actually. I remember them being asleep outside. Yeah, me neither. I know Wanda and her crew were here, but they need a savior. I would have expected a squad wipe. Then again, it's 15 versus a couple hundred. This is to be expected. And they're tired from so long, so yeah. they nerfed. Got beat up by Kaido once. Ooh. Waves. Luffy. Yeah. The Don. <laughs> <laughs> the man himself. Mm. We're just a flyby. <laughs> Day one moves. He sees a big crowd. He just knocks out everything. Mm -hmm. No hockey needed. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right. Without the Viper. I'm forever a fan. <laughs> yeah, go get him, brother. I'm so glad you're here. Sheesh. <laughs> Mm. Right. Oh. Drop the mansion on their head. Too easy. They need more slaves. Not nah, people. He got the vision. Mm. Are you asking about too much? <laughs> you trying to steal something, ain't you? Mmm. Ah, oh. got that dragon fruit from me. Who we give it to though? That's fish, fish, legendary fish. Is that what a dragon is? Keeping the main thing, the main thing. And who's you talking to? I'm still your big sister. Right. You still my little brother, Kaido. Yeah. Remember when I gave you that fish fish? Right. And I ain't talking about the cat cat. No, no. <laughs> the fish fish. Yeah. You, you owe, owe me one. Not a fish fish. See, I, that's what I was thinking. You know, a dragon kind of... Uh, so there's levels to Queen's Double Fruit or Queen's Body. He seemed to be like Frankie, a cyborg. That arm that he usually has, that's really his neck whenever he in dragon mode and it extends. It don't make sense for his arm to be transferred to his neck in his devil fruit state. He seemed to be a big bronchiosaurus that's probably a whole cyborg through and through. That explains how he started shooting cannons out of his throat. Probably. I thought it was all in his arm, but it's probably all through his body. It's just the fact that his neck had a solid form. You know what I'm saying? It was solid all the way through, no metal on his neck. Like his arm is visibly metal. Yeah. But Whenever he goes bronchiosaurus mode, there's no metal on his throat or nothing. So that's fire. Yeah, that's tough. That's dangerous. Mm -hmm. That makes him even more dangerous. He probably got that WAPO metal too. One hell of a play by Marco to apprehend Queen and King mid-air full Phoenix mode. Zoro's first to bat for the Straw Hats. Yep. First to get up there. It's just him up there with two emperors. Yeah. That's just different, bro. And he's waiting. Luffy about to come through. He's about to be a two on two. Man, Luffy's still running through the residence. Nope, he just got up the stairs. Past the, the stairs base. lead to the rooftop. He's there. Okay, so, so really Luffy is going to get there in time. Yeah. Luffy is going to pull up in time then to help out. Right. Because yeah, the minks just came off the roof. Mm -hmm. And they were getting overwhelmed by the ops and here on the floor. Nobody up. It sounded like Ace wanted to come out here to Wano and act up. The Whitebeard Pirates, they knew what happened in Wano. Of course, they got the news of Odin's death years later. Years later. But when it came to pulling up and avenging him, Whitebeard didn't feel like he needed to do that because 
he felt like, what's next? If we defeat Kaido and overthrow the government, who is he cool with? The only person he was cool with that was from there was Odin. He ain't yeah. cool with nobody else. Yeah, what's call it on the ship with us? Let him go in there. Izo? Yeah, let him go in there and dictate who the next Shogun is. We had enough to come back and avenge what we need to do. Well, who was going to take over the land? we more to do it than Ace. Who was going to take over the land, though? Who See, that's what Whitebeard was thinking about. He would have figured it out. Did Whitebeard want to run Wano? He didn't want to run nothing, it seems. He ain't never heard, I ain't never heard him have that's territory. That's too big of a territory. Yeah. Wano's too complicated. He don't fool with people's territory. And, I mean, Imagine he, Whitebeard I, going in there and taking over the land and... I mean, open it up, I guess, so... Uh, and then dealing with the government, the government's coming in trying nah, to get sea prism and stuff. He ain't trying to take over no lead, land man. like that. Got like, there's lead. no set leader, and he didn't know nobody that was gonna take over. Ezo from the block was gonna take over. I mean, Kinemon was doing great. Kinemon wasn't even there. Kinemon got teleported to the future. Oh, you're talking about after the loss. Yeah, we don't know nobody. If they heard about it years later, yeah, yeah, yeah that yeah. he died, Kinemon and them weren't even here. He heard that he killed Odin. And put a little bit of horror out of it, I put it. I think Whitebeard would have squared over Kaido, but I think it was the politics that kept him away. He know Kaido too well to know that it ain't gonna end well. He don't feel like having to y'all die off in the process. Facts. I love my family. He didn't want to put enough. his fam in somebody else's affairs like that. Even though he loved Odin, that was his second division commander. My brother. We haven't even filled that slot up. That's been vacant for forever. For real. For respect to the guy. Cause ain't nobody able to fill them shoes, them Odin-like shoes. I don't think he wanted to get invested in the Wano's confusing affairs because that land is bigger than most of the new world when it comes to the mysticism, the government's infatuation with the land or lack thereof, why they don't pull up. Why That's so a different isolated. place. We ain't, we, you just hear stories about it, really. Right, with strict rules. And we ain't go no further than freaking shoreline. Even when A said, I'm ready to go pull up now. The crew is still like, mm, that's a little dicey, my man. If the if Pop say so, you know. They killed Odin. <laughs> they killed Odin. <laughs> Odin died. Odin was scary. Right. You ain't know him like we know him. He was a real monster. Blackbeard was the only one supporting Nace's dream right there. I know what you want. You want a big dub, dub. Right, I'm with you. Wait till I hit the news. I know you want to be You want to be for white beard like that? Uh, 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 what am I saying? <laughs> <laughs> Started exposing true plans. <laughs> you want beef with an emperor. Me too. Mm -hmm. I want one of those. You had to calm down. Oh, <laughs> uh, he was getting agitated. One day I'm going to get me one. Then her ace was talking about promises. Promises? Mm -hmm. That's what gets you going? <laughs> Promise? Oh, you lame. <laughs> he thought he could bond with ace. I thought you wanted the bounty number. Right, you want the body. I want the body. <laughs> so he was cool with it. Blackbeard would have rolled out with ace. He would have. He gonna no support your dream, bro. With no devil for Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'll box with you. I'm with you, bro. Let's go get it. That's what I told you, bro. Yeah, he's dark. Even that response was dark. You know what I'm saying? Because ultimately, he's in it for the clout, the fame. He don't care about promises to the less fortunate. He's gonna come from there. He's gonna come from there, and he was hesitant. He rode Odin's He done got comfortable. <laughs> he's not going back to Wano, bro. I done seen some things on his pirate life. I, I like big boobies, and they like me too. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> the licks we've hit. This is an exciting life. It's a comfortable life. I'm eating good. The season's great. The season's Wano didn't treat me the best. Yeah. I used to dance for food, bro. Me and my brother out there in the cold. The source of my name, the difference between us is scale so vividly. Obvious while in the studio, I become Uber and then I start treating the beat like the mafia. You think the nearest just holler Jakarta's cause fire is proceeding from haters and sophomores. Me and my partners are represent Charlotte, the city that's North Carolina's metropolis. And we've been patiently waiting to display our greatness, showcasing our lyrical dominance. And it be